Hello everyone and welcome, this is iCrazyTeddy and welcome back to yet another High Life DLC informational video. In this episode we are going to be going through and breaking down the all new lavish and expensive newly added vehicles through the High Life DLC in GTA 5 Online. If you guys want to check out my previous video which was a heist confirmed release date video then I will provide a link in the description to that. And also if you guys are in need or sure of any cash in GTA 5 Online then I will also link my GTA Online Ultimate Money Guide in the description. With that said, leave a thumbs up rating on the video as it helps my content get more out there and branch out to a larger audience and everyone can hopefully know about these new awesome vehicles. If we could get 2000 likes then I will be releasing another awesome GTA 5 video later today. Finally for all the latest and best GTA 5 content be sure to subscribe as I am your number one source for GTA 5 DLC news and information. So to begin. All the vehicles in the High Life DLC update are all available to purchase in GTA 5 Online via the Legendary Motorsport app. And in single player simply visit your personal garage. So the first vehicle we're going to be taking a look at is the notorious Pegasi Zentorno. The Zentorno is heavily based on the Lamborghini Sesto Elemento featuring its shape. The circle holds at the back of the car and the triangular vent. The Zentorno has typical modern supercar styling. The front face of the car features many sharp edges giving an aggressive appearance. The hood is very sloped and curvy, it can be said that the Zentorno may be the Vaca's successor. As you guys know and can tell by the gameplay on the screen I have a banana skin Pegasi Zentorno in GTA 5 Online. The reason why I did this is kinda to distinguish myself from other players in GTA 5 Online. This might sound a bit cliche but just imagine wearing a monkey mask and jumping out of a banana car in GTA 5. That would be awesome. This is definitely my new favourite car in GTA 5 Online. The only downside is the hefty price of $725,000. But before we move further I would just like to ask you a question. What is your favourite car? And which DLC does it come from? Or is it just a standard vehicle in GTA 5 Online? Leave a comment below. Next we have the Massacro. The front face of this car is comprised with a range of curves. The bumper is dominated by the appearance of four grills. There's not really much we can say about the Masacro. For me, it kind of reminds me of a spin off of the Rapid GT. The Masacro costs a quarter of a million GTA 5 online dollars. And with that said, let's move on to the next DLC vehicle. Now we have the Enos Huntley. This is a SUV and one that, in my opinion, is a very underrated category, in my opinion. The Masacro caters for up to four people. The car itself is very nice, the armour and the bodywork as you guys can see I paired up mine with a chrome respray followed by a metal overglow. This thing looks like a fucking tank. The downside is the car's poor acceleration. The top speed looks pretty decent considering it's an SUV. Paired with the custom tyre and armour upgrade and a nice street transmission I think this can be an idea ideal vehicle for heists which, wi which will as Rockstar promised should be coming this spring. Now finally, last but not least, we have the new DLC, Dinka Thrust Motorcycle. The speed is better than the Batty 801 and the Batty 801 RR. The braking is better than the Double T, but the bike costs 75 grand which makes it the most expensive bike right now in GTA 5 Online. This bike may look the part but strictly speaking, I don't even think it's roadworthy. Now this is just my opinion from what I've seen, so I was driving and it was a nice sunny day and as I accelerated I hit the curb and popped a massive wheelie like never before. Personally I think this bike should be used for stunting and racing online. And with that said unfortunately that's all we have time for in this video. Tune in later today for another awesome GTA online video. Once again feel free to thumbs up this video and share it on any of your desired social media platforms. Follow me on Twitter for all the latest updates and gaming and all of that sort of good stuff. And like my Facebook page for more iCrazy Teddy. Let's try and get 2000 likes and finally to keep updated with the latest and best GTA 5 content click that subscribe button. It's free. FREE!